Ever wondered why some people snore while others don't? It's not just about being a loud sleeper. Often snoring is a complex issue rooted in several factors. Lifestyle choices, physical health, and your sleep environment can all play a part in this nighttime nuisance. For example, your mouth's anatomy or obesity might be the culprits. Even allergies and sleep posture can trigger those nighttime noises. But don't worry, it's not all doom and gloom. Once you identify the root cause, you can tailor your approach to tackling the problem. Whether it's adjusting your sleep position, addressing a weight issue, or even changing your pillow, there are solutions aplenty. So let's embark on this journey of understanding together. Because remember, understanding the root cause of your snoring is the first step towards finding an effective solution. Now that we've identified the potential causes, let's delve into how to control snoring with advanced tips and lifestyle changes. Sometimes, the solution to snoring isn't as simple as switching up your sleep position. It requires a more comprehensive, holistic approach that encompasses several aspects of your life. Firstly, consider your alcohol consumption. Alcohol has a relaxing effect on the muscles, including those in your throat, which can increase the chances of snoring. By reducing your intake, particularly before bedtime, you can significantly lessen the likelihood of those midnight symphonies. Next up is exercise. Regular physical activity can help to maintain a healthy weight, reducing the fatty tissue in the neck that contributes to snoring. It doesn't have to be a grueling gym session every day, even light activities like walking can make a difference. A healthy diet also plays a crucial role in controlling snoring. Overeating or consuming heavy meals before bed can lead to indigestion and acid reflux, which can lead to snoring. Try to have your dinner at least three hours before you hit the hay and focus on balanced, nutritious meals. Keeping a consistent sleep schedule is another key factor. When we're overtired, we tend to sleep more deeply, which can increase snoring. Try to get seven to nine hours of sleep each night and keep your bedtime and wake-up time consistent, even on weekends. Finally, don't underestimate the power of your sleep posture. Sleeping on your back can cause your tongue and soft palate to collapse to the back of your throat, causing snoring. Try sleeping on your side to keep your airways open and reduce snoring. Remember, a small change to your lifestyle can make a big difference in the quality of your sleep. It may take some time and patience to figure out the right combination of changes for you, but the reward of a peaceful snore-free night is well worth the effort. Are you ready to take matters into your own hands? Here are some DIY methods to help you tackle snoring head-on. First off, let's talk about throat exercises. Strengthening the muscles in your throat can prevent them from collapsing during sleep, which often leads to snoring. How do you do that? Well, you could try pronouncing certain vowel sounds loudly or even singing on a regular basis. Yes, you heard that right, singing. It's a fun and effective way to increase muscle control in your throat. Next, let's explore DIY nasal sprays. A simple saltwater solution can work wonders in reducing nasal congestion and allowing air to flow more freely while you sleep. Just mix a teaspoon of salt in a pint of water, fill a spray bottle, and voila. You've got yourself a homemade nasal spray. Use it before bed for best results. Now, on to one of the more unconventional methods, the tennis ball trick. This involves attaching a tennis ball to the back of your pajama top. It may sound strange, but it's a proven method to prevent you from sleeping on your back, where snoring is often the worst. The discomfort of the ball prompts you to turn on your side, which can drastically reduce snoring. Lastly, we have eucalyptus inhalation. This involves inhaling steam infused with eucalyptus oil to clear your nasal passages. Just add a few drops of eucalyptus oil to a bowl of hot water, lean over it, and breathe in the steam. This method can help open up your airways, making it easier to breathe and reducing the likelihood of snoring. Remember, these methods are easy, cost-effective, and can be done in the comfort of your own home. It's all about finding what works best for you, and it might take a bit of experimentation, but it's definitely worth it for a good night's sleep. With these DIY methods, you're well on your way to a quieter and more restful night's sleep. Despite your best efforts, there might come a time when professional help is necessary. It's essential to recognize that snoring is not just a nighttime nuisance. It can be a symptom of a more serious condition such as sleep apnea. This disorder, characterized by pauses in breathing or periods of shallow breathing during sleep, can have severe health implications if left untreated. Signs that may indicate the need for professional intervention include snoring loud enough to disrupt your partner's sleep or waking up gasping for air. If you find yourself feeling excessively tired during the day, or if your snoring is accompanied by a choking or gasping sensation, it's time to consult a specialist. 
these symptoms should never be ignored. After all, they can be indicators of underlying health issues that need immediate attention. Remember, there's no shame in seeking professional help. Your health and well-being should always be your top priority.